let's talk about another lady who we love, another artist. You and I see why. Who you calling a bitch? <laughs> That's the one. Uh, yeah. So, um, according to Deadline, multiple entertainment companies are joining forces to create a series of biopics about hip hop legends. And they are starting with Queen Latifah herself, who will be, who will also be co-producing the film. Queen Latifah said, it is a dream to be able to collaborate with friends and colleagues that have not only a shared understanding, but are able to tell these stories that were the backdrop of our lives. Hmm. More details about the upcoming film are coming soon. And so a Queen Latifah biopic is in the works. Uh, I love that she's a part of it. Yeah. I think that's great. Because, you know, you could tell my story, but it probably helps if I'm helping you tell my story, right? Right. Uh, and so I think that's one of the bonuses of, I need to keep holding my phone. I think that's one of the bonuses of people being around when their biopic is done. You know, when someone passes, you got to say, oh man, JD passed. We got to go call, you know, the homies. We got to find his peoples right. and see what we can verify and see what's important and what was important to him. And Make sure his story is told, but when JD is still around, you could just holler at JD and he say, all right, yeah, let's talk about it, you know? Uh, so I think this is cool. In fact, we were just talking, I know it hasn't come out yet, but we were just talking about biopics that we would like to see happen. Oh, yeah. And uh, hopefully something y'all will see soon that we are working, mm -hmm. and we did. Uh, we were just talking about biopics. And so I think this is really interesting that uh <laughs> it happens you know to be coming around the corner yeah. i also i really i'm really curious about who are these companies that are coming together to do this because it does not say specifically who is involved in this series of biopics and so i'm curious about that uh but i think it's dope that this is happening queen latifah has had a very interesting life and career mm -hmm. She's done acting, she's done Broadway, she's done rapping, she's, you know, yeah. I don't know, and shame on me for this because I probably should know, honestly, mm -hmm. I don't know if she had a bigger role than acting on Living Single, but I know when we were younger, it was kind of pitched as her show at one point. It was, basically. But I don't know Same. if she had, you know producer or director or creator credits on the show I and i probably should know that to be honest but i don't know about creator well. definitely producer and i feel like she was considered central to the storyline absolutely you know how most um most shows with an ensemble cast kind of have one person that bridges the gap, like bring, like brings everybody together. Everybody, everybody knows everybody because of that one person, or you know. Mm -hmm. um, so, so yeah, she, look was, it up. she was definitely a big part, a huge part of living single. Um, I was gonna say something about Queen Latifah, but I forgot. Uh, I was going to tell you, I was going to ask you, have I ever told you that she once waved to me? No. She, no, I did not. She once waved to me. We were, well, I was not staying at the hotel that I was at because okay. I couldn't afford that hotel. But, <laughs> but I was, <laughs> at least not at the time. Um, I, there was an event that I attended um, for work mm -hmm. and a long time ago jobs ago and I and there was kind of like a little after meetup soiree thing in a hotel lounge area mm -hmm. and it was like a little hotel like bar and lounge sort of thing and I guess she was attending the event uh, pretty sure okay. there and the hotel, 
she was staying at the hotel we were in. And lo and behold, it's like, I don't know, it's late. And who steps off the elevator? But Queen Latifah in her comfy clothes, too. She looked like she was just coming down for a little light bite or a drink. Nice. And uh, the group that I was with, everybody was kind of spread out. And she, you know, she came down and she actually talked to people. She was super friendly. I didn't get to catch words with her, but she did look over at the table I was at and, and we exchanged a wave. Nice. I mean, seems like a sweet human being. I'll say that, I, you know, again, we didn't really get to ch- chop it up. I'm not going to sit here and lie. You know those people who lie and be like, oh my gosh, I met Queen Latifah. She was so nice. <laughs> no. We both had an old fashioned at the bar. <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> no, but she waved. So <laughs> that's my story. <laughs> you know, people with the lies are wild. People with the uh, lies just are crazy. <laughs> Yeah, I just looked it up. She does not have any of those credits, just actress credits, okay. according to IMDb. I, I don't so. know why I thought towards the end she had producer credit, but maybe I'm thinking about the fact that she sang the theme song. Um, I don't know. Anyway, what are your thoughts about the biopic? I'm excited. I think she's a dope human. I think she's a she's a dope artist. And like you said, she's done so many thing she's so she's a multi-hyphenate like those are always the people i want to see uh, their stories like how did right. you how did you get to genius level greatness you know what i mean and i put genius yes. in quotes because we talk a lot about what genius means and i think genius means something different to everyone but to to be that involved with so many different things and to excel at it. Um, and you say living single, but honestly, isn't she still on a show um, right now? What's um, uh, the, the um, oh, the, not the enforcer, the uh, things like- Oh, the, Equalizer? The Equalizer. I don't know if she's still- doing that but i could find out right now i know she was doing it for multiple seasons i'm on my way to find her but yeah i mean she's done she's done some really dope things and yep 56 episodes of the equalizer still it says 2024 so that means episodes have come out this year yeah Um, and she is an executive producer on the equalizer as well it says she also has two projects coming out. Uh, one is in pre-production, one is in development. Mm-hmm. And she's done tons of movies. Um, yeah, of course. Obviously, you know, her music, I feel like that goes without saying. Um, mm-hmm. But I feel like she's just a super talented human. And like you said, I think it's really exciting that she's a part of it. So, you know... We'll get to find out. <laughs> well, it's probably going to be pretty authentic, um, considering she's a part of it, you know? So, and I say probably, because obviously people can lie on themselves. But you hope that that's not what happens when people tell their stories. Um, right, and we also don't know anything about it yet. It could be more of a comedy it could be more of an animated thing. We don't know. Yeah. We don't know enough yet. It could be Legos. It could, you know what I'm saying? It could be Legos. 